Hey guys, if you are in year 9 and doing your GCSEs already, you are in a great position. So here are a few tips for you. Doing your GCSEs over three years instead of over two years is brilliant. You should really, really thank your school that they have made this decision. It gives you much more time to learn stuff. It gives you much more time in class to go over stuff you don't understand. You get to do many more in science. You get to do many more practicals. This is a really, really good decision your school has made. So you should be thankful for this. But the problem with this is that the stuff you learn at the beginning of year 9, you're not going to be examined on until the end of year 11. And that's a really long time. Not only is that a really long time, but life happens in that time. Stuff is going to happen to you that you did not expect. It could, I don't mean to go doom and gloom here, you could have health problems, there could be problems um, at home with your parents, with your grandparents, with your brother and sisters, which could affect you. It is, it is a long time, we have to expect that something is going to happen. So, what you need to do is, like, not prepare for something bad to happen, but put yourself in a really good position so that if something bad does happen, you can cope with it. And what I mean by this is not just, like, you know, doing a work, bit of work in class and then forgetting about it till the end of year 11, but going over and over and over stuff. So, like, at the end of each lesson, just make a few flashcards or something and just put them in a pile and then go through the pile every so often. The constant revision of stuff will really, really help you when you go into year 10, when you go into year 11, when you get to this stage in year 11, when, um, I'm sure you notice the year 11's looking a bit stressed at the moment, when you start revising for things. If you leave it all to year 11, you will have three years worth of content for 10 subjects, all to do in a couple of months. Whereas if you start now, and you spread it out, it's gonna be so much easier for you. And if something does happen, you'll be just that tiny bit more resilient um, and be able to cope with what happens in relation to your schoolwork. You know, it's time to get into really good habits. I'm talking about looking after yourself. So sleeping well, um, eating well, exercising, looking after your mental health, taking time out of revision to read books, which is really good for you. If you don't read books, you need to start reading books. I'm serious about this. Um, taking time to get into good study habits, learning how to study well, not just colouring in revision guides, practising things over and over and over again. Um, if you are in year 9 and you have started, you are very lucky in all schools to do this and you are in a really, really good position. Um, I'm going to be here with you over the next couple of years and we can do this.